Click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, now we are going to discuss the unipolar logic families in detail. Let's start the discussion. So, our heading is unipolar logic family. So, in unipolar logic family, MOS technology is used. The chips comes under the unipolar logic families consist of MOSFETs. The long form of MOSFET is metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistors. These are unipolar logic families means only one carrier is used for the operation of the circuits. In bipolar logic families, two carriers were present for the operation of the circuits. Now, these unipolar logic families are broadly classified into P MOS, N MOS and C MOS. The P MOS is the oldest and slowest technology. NMOS is used for the LSI circuits that is large scale integration technology. So next is NMOS that is N channel metal oxide semiconductor. It is used in LSI circuits. LSI means large scale integration technology. And then we have CMOS technology. CMOS technology uses push pull arrangements. Because of that, it is used under the low power consumption circuits. This is the advantage of CMOS circuits because it uses very less amount of power. The examples are calculators. So we have fifth is what CMOS technology. It uses push pull arrangements of P channel and N channel MOSFETs and it is used for low power consumption circuits. This is the advantage of CMOS technology because it uses very less amount of power. Because of that, the speed of operations is efficiently we can done. Because of that, the speed of operation or you can say the operation related to the technologies we can achieve easily. This is all about the unipolar logic families. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned with Ikeda and subscribe to Ikeda.